Yep, that's right. Storage unit, art studio. I even recorded opening the door because I figured people wouldn't believe it when they saw this big window. My name's Tira Johnson and I figured I'd kick off my first YouTube video with moving into my studio. Some features, elevators, bathrooms, water, huge loading docks for when it's time to move big art and free carts to use actually at the office. Some things to keep in mind if you wanna do this for yourself is just ask permission to do it. Don't be sneaky. Before you sign your lease, just ask. You don't wanna get kicked out when you're working on something. I don't have a ton of use for electricity, but I did want access to at least one outlet for a lamp or when I need to use any kind of power tools or drills. I've got an elevator up to my unit because second floor and third floor units are cheaper. Climate control also will cost you more. So if you don't need it, don't have like you don't have to have it. Um, secure access. I wanted a code because if I'm working late, you know, I'm a woman by myself. I just wanted to be safe. And jumping right in where I'm moving my stuff in. I'm just unpacking here. So I'll point out some key features and things I've linked in the description below as you know, the next couple of minutes pass. Here, I'm just unloading some shelving that I got from Target. I've had it for a few years and I lost a few pieces when I was rolling it in, um, but I did find them. <laughs> so it, it is what it is. It's shelving on the left side of the screen. You will see a foldable canvas stool that I take to art fairs. What I'm setting up right now is a really nice easel from Jerry's Artorama. It holds up to 60 inches and it can actually be adjusted up and down. So you're not painting, screwing, you know, sculpting at a weird angle. Those drawers I just put on those shelves are from the container store. I think they're discontinued, but I'll link the closest thing that I can find. The highlight of this whole studio is this adjustable workbench right here. You're gonna see me put all my sculpting tools in this top drawer. And I've worked from here for a couple months now, and it is so nice to have my whole surface and just be able to reach down and grab what I need. So I'd highly recommend getting one if you can swing it. Last things here, are just finishing touches. I added some plants. You can't actually see, but I have a grid that runs across the top of my ceiling so I can actually hang things from the ceiling. And I probably left some things out. And if you guys have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments, but I did not want a YouTube video that was long for the sake of being long. <laughs> so if you have any questions or there's anything you wanna see up close later, just ask me and I can make more videos.